Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to do a demonstration of the bubbles versus the smart pop-up view floating notifications. So you can see the differences between the two. So first, let's uh, tap on the home button to go back to the home screen. And if I swipe down at the top with two fingers, I can tap on the option key, then tap on status bar. Next in here, I go down and tap on floating notifications. So in here I can choose between bubbles and smart pop-up view. So first let's choose bubbles and this is bubbles. So I'm going to send myself a text bubble pop-up. And this is bubble pop-up so it pops at the top and it does not show anything else. If you want to view the text message you can swipe down and tap on the text message in the notifications panel. Okay, so now we're going to go in and change it to smart pop view. And then you can turn on which apps can use this feature. So in the list here, all of them will be turned off by default. So you need to switch them on one app, um, each for, um, for each individual apps uh, for it to be able to use this feature. Okay, so I'm going to send myself another text. And this time you can see it shows the pop-up at the top as well as the smart pop-up view. So this floating button here is the smart pop-up uh, view. So if you tap on that, it will expand and shows the text message. You can make that windows larger or smaller. It will be floating on the screen. It will stay on top of another app. So if I have a phone application right here, you can see it will floating on the screen and stay on top of another app. Now, if I tap on this blue bar at the top here, it will pop up and it'll give me a number of different options. I can expand it into a full window. I can collapse it or minimize it. So I can collapse it back into this small pop-up and I can leave it there. I can also, um, I can also open um, split windows if there is another app. So it's, uh, let's say if I open up another app and then I tap on this blue bar here, I can turn it into a split a window so that I can use both windows at the same time. So for example, if I have a note application in here, I can view the text at the top and then use the notes application at the bottom. And that's it. So that is the differences between the two different types of uh, floating uh, notifications on the Samsung Galaxy S22 series. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel for more videos.